I was walking down Kentish Town Road in uh, northwest London, and um, I got a call from uh, Kevin Feige and Kenneth Branagh and Craig Kyle, and uh, they said I would like, would I like to play Loki in Thor? And I said yes, I would. <laughs> and then I had to sit down on the pavement for a bit um, so cool. and just think about it. <laughs> just sat down in the street. Very strange. Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. I remember meeting Kevin. I remember it being touted by Journo on the roof of um, of. Um, Bad Robot when we were doing press for Star Trek Into Darkness and I me mean, not even knowing who Doctor Strange was and going to the comics and going, well, that's kind of interesting, but maybe slightly obvious fit, clever, he's, you know, whatever. And then it just sort of grew in conversation. I first met with Joss not knowing which character we were meeting about because it was a secret <laughs> which characters they were introducing at the time for Quicksilver and Scarlet Witch. And... I didn't have to audition or anything, which I found strange, and got a phone call. I remember jumping on a bed and making the decision pretty quickly that oh. that was something I wanted to do. What? I thought you were in the interview or something like that. No, okay, I just right. remember, I got a call when I was in like West Virginia. I was on location and, and it was really, really exciting. And I was also just, I mean, I'm still confused why Joss was like, you, do it. <laughs> I, I don't know why, but that was very nice of him. I actually got that, I got that phone call on April 1st. So I, I was almost like in my so head thinking I'm in a fool's day situation. Oh. But I was, I was working on something. So, a, a, an un, you know, no, I, the unknown number kind of came in and left a, left a voicemail. And usually, you know, there either could be one of these calls or something terrible, but it happened to be Kevin Feige, I guess, and that was the... I was just at home, uh, I was on my computer, and I went on Instagram, and there was a, a photo on Instagram posted by Marvel saying that Tom Holland is the new Spider-Man. And uh, I went crazy, I was so happy, I was over the moon, and, uh, and then Kevin Feige then rang me and told me that, uh, that I got the part. For me, I, my agents called me, um, and they played a trick on me, um, and they, it was in October in 2016 and they kind of, yeah, played a trick on me. They were like, they were like, uh, um, Ryan wants to, to work with you for like five months on the script to like develop the character. I was like, what the heck? Like, that, who, why? Give me the role. And they're like, how would you like to work with him for five months filming? And I was just like, yes. And I was like screaming on the street. And then I had to go on a bus and act like nothing. Like my like my world didn't just change. Tap my little oyster, doo -doo, and then just like <laughs> kept kept on going. It's a good day. I was just coming out of a meeting where a producer had told me that I'd never work again in Hollywood, and I went wow. And I sat down on the sidewalk, the pavement, um, on Sunset Boulevard, and my phone rang, and I didn't recognize the number. Uh, and I answered it, and it was Joss Whedon. And he said, do you want to play Vision in the Avengers? And I went, yes, I, yes, I do. And, uh, uh, yeah, they uh, totally turned things around for me. <laughs>